Myriad of Celestia trailer. History of the Zhanzhou Exodus of Five Dragons. What is this? I have traversed great lengths seeking a piece of history. The history Who's that? of long the permanence. Okay. I too know little of the progenitor of all dragons. Bro, bro, every Hoyoverse game. Bro, you couldn't do five fishes. You couldn't do five turtles. You couldn't do five Gundams. Bro, dragons for everything. For everything. Now, am I complaining? No, but I'm just saying, guys. No, we can do phoenixes, birds, stars, suns. Because dragons are literally the coolest. Okay, you know what? I disagree. I think dragons, five, or sorry, five dinosaurs would have been cooler my opinion okay you have like a velociraptor a pterodactyl a triceratops a t-rex and that would be sick before the dawn of history that looks crazy traverse the burgeoning chaos seeking the answer to existence that is so and sick on that path the revelation of the permanence was unraveled oh then shit came emergence us long scions i visited liara's a world encircled by five suns. Okay. First of all, what a visual. Did we just get leaked another planet? So so we have Punk Lord. We have the one where Kafka was at. We have the robot world, Laoris, another planet. Jesus Christ. Dude, we, yeah, we also have Pentaconi. Dude, dude, holy shit. We have so many places we need to go on. The IPC will probably be a place like the Zhanzhou Lofu where we're like floating on a ship in space. And circled by five suns. Yep. The giant dragon sat overseeing that is crazy. day and night. That is crazy. Seasons, sheltering the lives within. Could the revelation of the permanent signify the timeless nature of one's greatness? The relentless pursuit of individual immortality will only breed an unending multitude of malevolent creatures. Some I don't know what he just said, but true. Plague's author. So then does the permanence represent the continuance of bloodline? I also journey to the ancestral home of the Infernalian people in the land of white embers. The undead dragon Typhon's breath showered flames on the land below. Is that another planet? Dude, the undead dragon? Bro, it looks like Deathwing. Dude, a, a completely undead planet with like skeleton creatures and zombie girls? Holy f that would be so cool. We we could be in store for some damn good some some, some damn good journeys. Cause I'll say dude, Punk Lord is probably my number one planet I'm excited to go to. You know, like video games and gamer girls everywhere, bro. Hitting the TikTok dance, twerking and shit. That's gonna be crazy. But undead bone zone with emo big titty goth girlfriends, bro, that's gonna be nuts. Bringing forth a flourishing limb. Long scions are dispersed throughout countless worlds, living in solitude. Okay, now, interesting. Now, why, that, that's obviously, now, would we agree that that's Don Hang? Or is that a completely different guy? Because this is either Don Hang and then Bibber Lune form, or it's another guy. It's another guy? It's a different guy. Jeez, is that Don Fung's dad? Or is it Don Fung? It, it's his cousin? It's his reincarnation. And Bibber Lune, but not Don Hung. Diff hordes? I got no idea, bro. Don Fung, Don Bung, Don Hung, Don Kung. I don't know, bro. In the vastness of the Dan universe, the rise and fall of one race is of little consequence. Oh my God! Holy shit! With the Shenzhou, and that, that okay? You gotta admit that's a rip from Dragon Ball opening. Okay, or sorry, Dragon Ball Z. That is Dragon, Dragon. What the Dragon? That is, that is a straight rip from DBZ. It is said that the Vidyana that is Shenron, brother. With the Shenzhou, and that five elders descended upon the mortal realm to keep watch over the plague mods. Perhaps the permanent system. No hey, hey, dragons and a big ass tree. The formula to make a Hoyo verse game. Okay, dragon, big ass tree, shit rates. Even worse community. <laughs>
You know what I love? You know what all these, you know what I love? I, I, I got a, I got a, uh, I got a aha, like a full circle, like a, a truly a vigilante moment where years ago in days of yore of Genshin Impact, I, I told content creators over and over and over again that they have to speak out against the Twitter community of Genshin Impact. And they said, no, 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 you shouldn't do that. You only make them angrier. We have to ignore them. And then I'm checking their Twitters now and now they're calling out the Twitter community because they realize, oh yeah, he's right. So you know what's great? There's two types of people. People who get that Tectone's right or people who don't get that Tectone's right yet. Why British? Because the three-head emote is funny. Condition that ensures the safety of the universe. <sighs> Alas, Symbibiter Lune forsook his oath, causing a state of great disorder. The High Elders, too, bear mortal frailties. Yep. Their heavy burdens ultimately becoming the shackles which bind them. I love that From line. perspective. What does the Permanence's revelation truly signify? A upcoming dope-ass patch with 2.0? Boys, here's the reality, okay? Every update for Honkai Star Rail has been an absolute slammer. Tenpole, tenpole, new update, new content, new lore, new scenes, new main story quests, banger. Imagine when 2.0 comes out. I can't even imagine. I, I can't even imagine. I cannot even imagine. When we get when we get that free five star selector ticket, boys, that is gonna be nuts. That is gonna be nuts. As the sun and moon rise and fall, the world undergoes continuous change. Yep. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Yeah, what he Only said. By comprehending and aligning with the way of the world, can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Yep. Countless new creations emerge when one dragon meets its end among the morning stars. Hold up. Are we missing dragon lore? Hold up. So who do we have? Sun and moon rise and fall. The world undergoes continuous change. So we have Kalorum Venti. Venti? No, surely not. Imagine if Venti came over as a Honkai Star Rail character where he's half dragon. Oh my god. Oh my god. That would be nuts. I actually love Venti. High elder of the Yao Jing, successor of the Wing Dragon, sovereign of storms, bound to watch over the Lunar Emperor. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending and aligning with the way of the world. Arden's Regia, High Elder of the Zooming, successor of Horn Dragon, wielder of Heavenly Flame, bound to watch over the primordial flame. World can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Countless new creatures. Gladiator Marum. High Elder of the Fang Hu, successor of the Scale Dragon, tamer of the Ebbing Frost, bound to watch over the miniature myriads. Or sorry, Glaciator Marum. among the morning stars. For the Vidyatara, this is the true teaching of the per Mon's Grandest High Elder. He looks sick as f Mon's Grandest High Elder of the UK. Successor of the Terrestrial Dragon, founder or ponderer of the Congealed Silence, bound to watch over the fallow Earth. Within the cycle of life, any endpoint may mark the inception of a new journey. Embibitor! There's our mother boy! It is no different. He's so hot! Bro. Bro, now I get why his actual trailer was so mid. Because they were saving the big guns for this one, dude. What a f slammer. You know what's really... The, the, the regular inhibitor, inhibitor Lunae trailer was so mid, I didn't even post it on YouTube. So you know what? Let's watch it right now. A scion of permanence. Yep. Embarbiter Lunae, successor of the Azure Dragon. Commander of the clouds and the rain. Yep. Task worth watching over the ambrosial. His abilities are so cool, man. In reckless arrogance. That tra or that uh, that transition is so clean. Guilty of unpardonable sins. I still don't get what he did. By death. Oh, you can kill me any day of the week, brother. 
Yes, sir. The yes, sir. Fantilia, if you wish to obstruct me, you'll have to do better. You're flawed. So sick. It's so cool. So, you now presume redemption yep. is within your grasp. Yep. Oh my god! Fight for a new life. Delve hidden moon, world cleansing dragon. Woo! Do you really think you have a choice this time? That's absurd. I'm waiting. Dude. My pre the reason why that trailer's mid is because we've already seen the majority of those animations in-game. But regardless, that new trailer was sick. I genuinely feel that that Venti dragon is going to be Venti from, from Genshin. Because I don't think they would name the same character twice. That's a very big character to name twice. But we'll see. Regardless, I'm stoked. Looks good.